ever wondered what the monster under your bed looks like? Um, it looks like that. Yeah. So, I just got done vacuuming, and that's what turned up. I had to pour out, like, I don't know, seven, like, run-throughs of the house. Not run-throughs of the house. This room. This is the room that I had to vacuum up that got most of that. That's where our bed used to be. Speaking of which, it's now here. I have a new bed for the meantime, anyway. Um, my bed is with that, actually. My bed is the middle layer. And uh, it just doesn't have any of the boards and stuff, so it's not technically my bed as a whole. It's just my mattresses. Um, but yeah, they're getting a new bed in there, so... I might be able to keep their bed. If not, then their bed's gonna go into the, the dump or the new bed because it's not really new. What the new bed is, is it's a um, from my great grandmother, right? It's like, she bought it, it's pretty new. She doesn't want it anymore, so she, she, got, a, um, she got a smaller bed, right? And, um, well, she's giving us it. And so I got their bed. Ended that story. And uh, if you're wondering why my nose is so red, it's not because I'm related to Santa Claus. It's because I got sunburned, and that's the only part that didn't heal yet. Yeah. Well, you can kind of see the pink right there, but you know, whatever, whatever, whatever. Anyway. Big dog. The end. I said the end. I keep missing the button. The end.